Welcome back everyone to Whip CPO Play Spiral Dragon. Uh, last time we got all the gems from, from Artisan Home and completed Stone Hill in terms of gems and dragons. So, let us continue. Now, last time I talked about these metal balls here. You'll get them by all, like I've already said, defeating enemies you've already beaten. Uh, you get an equal amount to the amount of uh, uh, the gems that um, they would usually give you. So the thieves they would give you about five, which is an easy way to stock up on these things. But the game alone is so easy that you really don't need all these lives unless you really don't have a, have a goddamn clue about what you're doing. Um, you probably also noticed something new. No more intro, no more outro. And I'm trying to speak louder now, getting the perfect sound. So, here we go. Town Square. These chickens will now take the place of the sheep, so... Yeah, that's a new way of getting health, I suppose. So... Moving right into this, um... Oh, we had a lag pill. Um, we can easily... Okay, I apologize. I seem to have forgotten the whole egg situation. But you can see not much has changed and yeah, but when we get later on in the game, um it will uh, be more and more gems you have to collect each stage. Welcome to Town Square, Spyro. Thank you. That was very pleasant to know. So, now we're actually fighting bulls. Damn, that was my challenge. We could just leave him like that, but he'll get right back up. So, may as well put him out of his misery. You lost, and you'll have to live the rest of your life knowing so. You don't want that now. These things, um, you breathe fire and collect the gem. Pretty simple, but can be a bit can be a bit awkward when you do it the first time. So yeah, another life I don't need. And obviously you'll die if you fall down that hole. Rescuing another one. Thanks, Pyro. <laughs> I had the worst itch on the tip of my wing. Oh, did you know? I probably should have stopped after he said the words the worst itch. Oh well. <laughs> you failed. Now. Now that he's dead, let's move on. And I can already heal the blue thief, so let's get moving. After all, they've stolen from us. You horrible creatures. And that comes from me. <laughs> ah, anyways. They're not so e so difficult to take down. Ah, oh, damn it. Um, you could just run close to them and the. God damn it! What? Oh, come on. You really gonna do that to me now? Fuck oh, this. Uh, let's try again. Um, but, like I tried to do, um, you could just run really close and then breathe fire on them. Um, you need a good timing though because for some reason my keyboard is not the most responsive right now. It's either that or the frame rate. how would I know? So, taking down this feed, getting another dragon egg, you're feeling bastard. Um, so, someone commented on my other video saying that it's um, seems a bit boring with enemies that can't really harm you and all you have to do is uh, rescue dragons and collect gems. Uh, the one I just took out, they, um, you just continuously heat it up until it, um, yeah, like you saw, it blows up. Thank you for releasing me! And that will be a recurring line throughout this game. Now you're warned. <laughs> well, 
Yay! Two with one hit. <laughs> no reason in doing that, but just find it very amusing to do so. Uh, so, we're almost done here. Pretty short stage. Most of these are in the beginning. Spyro, did you see a man dressed in blue running around here? Nope. But he's one of the guys that tells you. He's the one that tells you that the dragon eggs have been stolen. Ole toro. <laughs> and no, I don't speak Spanish. It never really caught my interest to actually learn the language. Of course, no offense to any Spanish person who might be watching this, but yeah, that's just my opinion opinion on this whole thing. Um, I think I missed. Uh, let's see, where could that be? Well, I missed that one. Not good. Uh, let's see where else I missed. Yeah, it will probably be up here since I think. No? Oh, there. I'm starting to have a good cause of amnesia right now. Uh, that's probably not a good thing, but you know, it happens. And seeing as this stage is so short, I will try and do another one. And hopefully the sound will come out alright this time. Otherwise I'll have to be doing this one more time. Not that I mind it, but you know, I would like if it worked out the first time. Um, a very bad hit bit on him. <laughs> Crush. And burn his ass. Yay. Moving on. Um, so, all we have left is one more stage and a boss battle. And then we're. Well, we're done with this one. And I put that in quotation because. We still need one more flying stage, but we won't know about it until someone tells us in World 3, I suppose? Yeah, probably somewhere around that. Um, it's not that I'm not well informed, but I haven't played this in quite a while. So the next stage, Dark Hollow. Do you pronounce it that way? I suppose. <laughs> so, Starry Starry Night. Just watch it. So pretty. Moving on. I probably shouldn't be doing this anymore. Um, anyways, pretty short stage as you can see. And, well, let's get it over with. These guys you cannot burn. They have a shield to protect themselves. And a dagger. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> what just happened? Not that I wasn't watching, but... You know... So bad physics in this game. Now, aren't you a threatening one? Well, the big enemies, you can't, you can't charge into them. There are one exception, but that happens way later. Uh, headbutting my head on a wall while defeating two guys. So, rescuing the next one. Oh, it's you. I wasn't sure if you'd escape those annoying little creatures. Of course, they wouldn't bother me, but here's a hint. Metal armor is fireproof, but a charge attack will take care of them. Oh, really? I mean, what if a little child don't know about this until he somehow manages to get there? Not that it's difficult, but I've seen children ra rage over the most simple things before, so don't see why not. These guys suck. You suck. Go pray to your knighthood. That made no sense. <laughs> so. Just for the win of it, I think everyone who's played this will do this. I mean, it just seems like the right thing to do, so to say. These guys are wearing um, metal armor, so you'll have to get them from behind. I mean, he's ass, my son. No. Um, you won't see many of these. Uh, the next ones 
I think will show up way later. Yeah, obviously my memory isn't the best one, so you'll have to excuse me if I'm wrong. But we'll see by then, I suppose. So, taking out this little key. And now we can open that treasure chest. Collecting the final one here. Um, using the top platform, obviously, and freeing this guy. Funny name. Want to know a secret? Press triangle to look around. Why, thank you. At least I hope that's what he was trying to say, because I believe that's one that'll tell you about the L2 and R2 button. But I don't know when he shows up, so... Yeah. Now I told you about that triangle secret. Keep it a secret! You probably can't hear this when, <laughs> when I'm done recording, but... Yeah. If you still do, you better do it. Or I'll savagely murder you. Um, anyways, we're almost done. Damn it, we're almost done here. Um, and as you might guess, um, no ladder climbing in this game. A very awkward um, stair climbing, so to say. Damn, that was a close one. <laughs> But anyways, um, yeah, I don't know when the next part will come up, um, but I hope by the end of this one that the sounds have improved enough, at least to a certain extent, that it's presentable. Now someone should start messaging me on Facebook. No, that can't be right, I don't even have it open. That would be very extreme if you could still receive me Facebook messages and hear them, even though you don't have the website open. I think Mark Zuckerberg made that made that for people who are excessively addicted. Big enemies like this Gnork with the club. Thank you for telling me that late. By the end of this stage, actually, <laughs> they really didn't plan this one out too well. But there would be no challenge if we were just told everything, I suppose. So, that's the end of part 2 guys, I'll see you next time, and I'm not going to act like a whore, so see you next time, peace out.